Alright, so when you guys need to use a saw, you need to make sure there's water in it first. And there is a little water line, water mark on the front. Right here, it shows you how much water you should put in there. I need more. <laughs> okay, so this saw has to be in the water. Sometimes when you put this back in here, it's not down all the way. You just lift this lever in the back and make sure it's down in the water all the way. Thank you. Okay. If it's a little underwater, under the water mark, that's fine. Sometimes it gets too much water. Okay, then you put this grid on here. Make sure you don't bend the blade. And this is just like a jigsaw, so you can cut in any direction. Make sure it's down all the way. Alright, this is how you turn it on. And you'll see the water comes out of here. So you always want to have a dry rag next to you. So when you are cutting your piece, your pattern is going to get wet and you don't want it to peel off. So while you're cutting, just dab it every once in a while to get that water off. Okay. Make sure you're wearing safety glasses. And when you're cutting on the saw, you always want to push forward. So even though you can cut however you want, you don't want to push sideways on the blade because the blade will come off and you'll break the saw. This is very expensive. So please always push forward and just turn your piece however you need to so you're pushing forward. And you don't want to push hard at all, okay? So it's just like the grinder, you're just pushing very gently. Remember, you don't want to get too close. It's, it's easy to get too close. So don't get too close because remember, you can always grind the outsides. Sometimes you'll get corners or curves that you cannot grind because the grinding bits are too wide. So you can use this kind of as a grinder if you want to go really slow and kind of grind that piece in there. <laughs> as a grinder you're not going to push on it all you just kind of rock your piece back and forth and it will grind those little pieces away okay I only want you to use the saw on pieces that you can't cut out with a glass cutter if everyone's constantly using this people are fighting over it and it breaks this is gonna last us 10 years so we can't have people using it constantly okay do you guys have any questions on the saw it is super super easy to use so don't try to cut out a hard piece with a glass cutter and break it and keep trying and re-gluing it and keep cutting it because you're scared to use the saw. Okay, this is super easy to use and you'll you'll figure that out right away. Okay?